What's up, Jaywalkers? We are back with another reaction. We are going to be watching Season 2, Episode 11 of Glee. Last episode was the Christmas episode, and it was a good one. It got me in the Christmas spirit in freaking February. Uh, but there were some good, some good performances in that one, and really loved the Christmas miracle that already got to walk a little bit. Beast was incredible in that episode, and shined more so than anybody. Beast outstanding. We had a little bit of Sue as the Grinch, but a wholesome ending as Sue and all of the Glee students went to Will's place so Will would not have to spend Christmas alone. Very sweet, sweet thing to do and I really just love how close this Glee group still can be at times. Uh, but we're excited for episode 11, guys. The full reaction will be over on my Patreon page. Link to that will be in the description box of every video on YouTube. If you want to check that out, feel free. But with that being said, we're going to jump into it. Let's go. Freaking loving the blue hair on everybody. Although I do got to say this performance seems a little over the top already. But I'm loving it. Not a single person can deny that Katy Perry had bop after bop. Bored by all of that? Ladies, I am at a loss. The fuck, Sue? Bring about the Dallas Cowboy cheerleaders. Call the Dallas Cowboy cheerleaders. <laughs> that is correct. In the meantime, very interesting what's title. Changed. Very catchy. What's changed is I have completely <clears throat> lost interest. And ladies, I blame you. Becky, more silicone falsies. Cut, cut. Harsh. You will each enhance your bust with an additional pair of chicken cutlets and an attempt to add some jiggle to what is the most boring routine. I have ever witnessed. But Coach Sylvester, this is the most elaborate routine the Cheerios have ever done. We're shoo-ins at regionals next week, and we're the favorite to win at nationals. Yet I am still so How? very bored. How the hell was that Even boring? Even things I used to think were hilarious. Case in point, sandbags. Slap yourself with a chicken cutlet. Now slap Brittany. See? Not even a chuckle. The you, problem you've is never truly you lived until you can slap with a piece of chicken. No matter how hard we try, we can't make a routine work unless you find a way to make it interesting. Okay, here we go. Get already in the game! Kinley history. Football is back, bitch! Yeah. Why is he shaking his head? Those are we decent speech. We should a song after we win. Hey, hey, shut it, Kroft. No freaking way. I figure if I stay on you, you'll run away. I, you know what? I think it'd be pretty fun. fucking awesome if they broke into a song after they win. I think that'd be pretty cool. I think the crowd would love it. Everyone would love that. Everybody gay all the time, but you never seem to have a girlfriend. Oh, <laughs> damn! Like hell to get sacked by him. I'd kick him off the team. I'd kick him right off the team. All right. I know Finn's not the coach. You can't do that, but Ready? this man's gonna get Finn killed. Oh my god. Well, his own teammate what did kind of put the fear in him. What the hell happened? Finn, you're the captain. Deal. It's embarrassing. We're dudes. Getting all hot and bothered about singing a Kesha song. It's There's not one single thing wrong in this world with singing a motherfucking Kesha song. Or Katy Perry. Or anybody, for that matter, singing is freaking beautiful. Swing it, Puckerman. A good yeah. 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 Damn. Journal. All I know is I'd run through a wall for bees. Just to feel something. Wait, it's Sir Lester, right? Sue Sir Lester? How do I make <laughs> it? It is now. Again? How do I get I'd have to change my name. This is flowing. Um, I don't know if that's the right kind of inspiration. Okay, all right, Sue. So bigger and better than ever. Literally. This here is the A950. It's gonna get somebody killed. I'm saying it's probably gonna break someone's neck, and a freaking law lawsuit will be on our hands. Of course, catastrophic failure, which is a 30% chance of catastrophic success. And Sue's a gambler. She'll take those odds. Oh my God. Well. Say hello to God for me. Okay, it's okay. I'll take it. 
You got a smaller one? Well, I'll check the hook. This might be the worst deal of a lifetime. I'm back. <laughs> no, you're not so back. Back in butt. prison after no, someone no, no, dies. No, no, no. You rely on the chemistry. They don't have to like each other, but they have to respect each other. I mean, this whole thing is just so That's weird. Such a good coach. I mean, half of your starters are in my glee club. I just don't know what to do. Do you trust me? You're not gonna try and kiss me again, are you? If you trust me, <laughs> I think I know a way to get your team united again. I thought he was gonna say, if you trust me, oh my God, I might Artie. kiss you. It was awful. Fucking cross That's the it. line. Give a warm welcome to the newest members of Glee Club. What? 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 Give a cold welcome. This is gonna be mayhem. Part of common ground. All of you are gonna be in this Glee Club for one week, no exceptions. She's bluffing. Sorry, Next week is the championship slushies. game. Without us, she has no team. With you, I have no team. You guys oh. have gotta find a way to come together, or we're gonna get our ass. Do you even have any idea what we do in here? No, <laughs> none of them do. We have to show them. Rachel, Puck, haven't you guys been working on something? Why don't you give it a whirl? Fine. As offended as I am by their presence here, I won't let anything get in the way of a performance. Yeah, I know, Rachel. I know. That's what I love about you. Sometimes. Memories scattered all around the floor. Mm. Ever crossed your mind. Songs I really haven't heard in a while, but songs I For me like a lot. Beast is filling it. Beast is about to cry. Me too. Look, look, he's getting into it. Damn, their voices sounded amazing right there. Pug just swooped in, sounded like a gosh damn angel. I'm actually like really, really, really loving Pug's voice in the song. The girl with the mohawk had a really nice voice. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I mean, hopefully it'll get better, but it's gonna take some time. Hey, hey. we used to be best friends. Uh, so your girlfriend pregnant yeah, and yeah. Made out with your other girlfriend. Yeah. yeah. Anyways, kind of hard, kind of hard for anyone to be your friend after that. With me to make Finn jealous. <laughs> Nothing like that will ever happen again. You lead, and I got your back. <laughs> we need to win this championship and become legends. Finn, you're a lot bigger than I am. Congratulations. You're doing this stunt for the big competition. Not Britney. Don't put Britney in there. I don't want to die yet. At least not until One Tree Hill gets canceled. Fine. But your toddler... Shout out to One Tree Hill. I think it's going to explode in there. Yeah, that looks so there safe. There are dangers involved. It's the same as when a quarterback. You don't gotta add that danger to anything. Slammed up against Sue. the boards. Enough. I need this. This level of risk and danger makes me feel alive again. But the risk and danger makes you feel alive. It's gonna kill other people. That's the best part. Enough. It's decided. You're not allowed to fire anyone out Thank of you. that cannon without their consent. Without their consent. I wish he wouldn't add that part. Someone's gonna. Oh God! One That's of my favorite awesome. things in the show is just freaking Sue, just I wish you going around Sue. shoving kids. I think Sue might have fully lost it this time. Thought it a few times before, but I'm almost certain here. First half, change it to some sequin bars. It's a lot of work. That would be. That would be tiring. Championship game. Yes. It's the championship game! During the most physical it's game, too, against the best team. Miss out on right. us doing the most iconic song of all time. The Super Bowl of pop anthems. Thriller. Oh, that's gonna be oh. fucking incredible. Titans, Titans, we're going to zombie camp. Zombie camp? Sounds hella five, fun. Six, seven, eight. These look like some pretty... Ridiculous zombie so far. You're creative, I like that. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight. Mike is the greatest zombie. Mike is the best zombie. No one can tell me otherwise. Right. She's really good. If you took that energy you used bullying people and put it into this, 
You'd be one of the most put it into anything in else besides bullying. Just think about it. So they're gonna have to play a football game, then do all this makeup, go out and freaking do a crazy performance, and then go back in the second half. Putting them through a lot. They really are. Around here after dancing around like an idiot in front of the whole school as if we kick ass at. You could have just, you know, not added any of that. Yeah. Couldn't agree more. Zombie I mean, is funner than tiny I bit of growth, I guess. I'm torn. Well, I'm not. I'm Brittany. I think they should keep the makeup on as they play football. It would look kind of scary. It would look cool. Enjoying the eavesdropping. It's going to get Brittany killed. Is that really worth it just to win a stupid national championship? Seventh consecutive stupid national championship. This is ridiculous. You had quite a year last year, Q. Everything she does is quite ridiculous. You have such a good time out of that Cheerios uniform. Ladies, I am giving you the chance right now to choose once and for all where your true loyalty is. Don't do it! So naive. This whole school is about labels. Wow. I never realized you were so freaking weak. Oh, what I... did you say? All the Cheerios quick glee club. So don't you talk to this girl like, like that! Oh, shit! Team. Maybe you? As in, yes. Well, maybe we should settle this right now. Bring it. We're wrong. We don't need to be doing this, guys. We're supposed to be getting closer. Oh, yeah. Really, guys? Really? Hey! hey. You're not fighting with the other people. Don't fight with each down. other. I kind of like Sam coming up though. Getting no open for yelling at this girl. Zo I'm not gonna lie, zombie arty is actually terrifying. Fun. Guys, it's pretty fun. <laughs> Appropriate outfits. They represent the death of the freaking hockey club now is gonna start slushing people. Sometimes we have to put you puckheads in your place before you realize that football rules. Puckheads. Maybe, but not after you make dancing. Why is Puck not a member of the hockey team? It would make too much sense. You know it. We know it. Puck. The whole school knows it. <laughs> Just relax. It stops after a couple hours. No freaking way I'm letting that happen again. <laughs> a couple He's hours? Stage. More like a team than you ever have out on that field. I don't care. I'm out. Then you're off the team. Mm. If we stand together, we do the halftime show. Everyone stand in together. Place. Good luck with that. Damn. Or let's not stand together at all and walk away. Like baby. I'm already liking the start of this. <laughs> no things you did no more. You're slowly making me pay for things your money should be there. My car. This is freaking eargasmic. Hold some money from me until you get your check next week. You have it. I found another. A baller. When times goes, can you pay my telephone bills? Do you pay my automobiles? If you did, then maybe we could. Not that type of brother. Silly me. I have it. I found it. Don't think you do. No. So you and me. At this point, the only thing I wish is that is that Mike Chang was here to, to do this little dance part. He would kill it. That's the only thing I wish. But this performance, it just seems like such a like a fun one to perform. Guys, let's say we're ready for regionals. They're just vibing. So getting everyone at the school together. Why hasn't Finn told me anything about this? I mean, we live together. I mean, I bring him a glass of warm milk every night just in hopes that we'll have a little lady. How do you guys talk about ever? You only need four more guys. High school regulations actually let you play a couple guys short if you want to. That doesn't sound smart, though. If they figure out a way to make it work, you can bet that we'll definitely be there to cheer them on. Oh, totally. Blaine and I love football. Well, Blaine loves football. I love scarves. <laughs> I, I want to be friends with Blaine. I cut 30 Talks guys from the tryouts at the beginning of the season. You're telling me not one of those guys wants to play? It's like crossing a picket line. Nobody wants to be a scab. Put me in, coach. I'll go play. We who? All of us are playing girls. We yeah. We're on the football team. Yeah. yeah. Thinking about it at first, thinking it wasn't, you know, uh, the best idea, but... You know what? I'm, I'm kind of reconsidering that. Have you seen a tackle football game? When they tackle you, it hurts. <laughs> yeah, not in the good melon camp way. We thought about that, but the truth is, is that you guys don't really need us to play. You just need enough players out there to field a regulation team. So when they snap the ball, we're just going to lie down on the ground. We're just going to lie there. <sighs> no, I'm not. 
I'm I don't know. I, I guess I fully believe that. Into the football team. Yes! Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we will see how it goes. You don't climb in that. Camp. I believe in them. <laughs> I believe in them. No pal. They can get it done. You refuse to sign this. Well, those little baby cannons might just go hungry. Baby cannons. And the mama cannon has fibromyalgia, so she can't work. Brittany, please. Please. For the baby cannons, I guess. Oh shit! God Come me. on, they're about to bring the pain! What the hell are they doing? Playing on like you guys. I'm just gonna be honest, I wouldn't want to be hit by 79. Yeah. Are you ready for this? Let's kick some ass! Yeah. Let's kick some ass, Rachel! Oh, do not line up like that, please. What? Oh. My God, Finn, that's on. Yeah, that's a bad throw. Bad throw. A long game. Kill me now. I wanna <laughs> die. Is anyone else tired of lying down all the time? I wanna play. Just come on, Just Tina. Oh shit! Come on, Tina. Make the play. Make the play. No way she's gonna get a touchdown. No way. No, she's gonna die. Oh my god. Oh! No, she's alright. That tackle was not bad. Come on, Tina. Get up and celebrate. She's got to get up and celebrate. Tina, you good? Did we win? With freaking your heart, we can't lose. When the half ends, you got to go convince Karofsky and the rest of the guys to do the halftime show with us. How the hell am I supposed to do that? Figure it out. You're Puck. Wingman, right? You can do anything. I'm gonna die. <laughs> It'll be worth it. At least you accepted it. It won't be hey. worth it. No, it won't. You guys, she's fine killing Brittany. Tell me honestly, if you didn't think it would hurt your reputation, which would you choose? Clay Club. Mm. That's all that matters. I know you. What about you, Santana? Screw her. She put me on the bottom of the pyramid. <laughs> Come on, and no one, a few no one disrespects Santana no like that. Some Sucks for you. There we go. Sue, you better get in that cannon yourself. I don't hear from any of you. you all bunch of cowards. 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 Losers. Yeah, you don't need loser losing this game. You're so afraid of being called geeks or losers or gay that you settle for being nothing. Damn. I'm in. Me too. I think no when. Come on, man! I really want to win this. Of course, he's he's making this difficult. But I think uh, when Beast retires from being a coach, I think next coaching line should be Puck. Too sweet. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. All right. He'll come around too. It's just being extra. You could be in there having fun. But no! Jump in there! Smile! Let loose! Come on! Put the jersey up! There we go! Body starts to shiver. For no This is awesome. I will forever see zombie Artie in my nightmares. Oh, we're gonna take our zombie makeup off for the second half. It's Hell no, leave it on. No. Look scary. Go. Come on. We'll freak out the other guys a little bit, and we need all the help we can we get do. right now. See, this Look is why Beast. There. All of us is a good coach. Yeah, all of us. The team is back. <laughs> See what happens when we can come together. Welcome back, boy. Get out there. See what happens. They're about to win this game. All right, momentum switch. Momentum switch. A bit. A bit. Hey, you might as well, you know, play the whole part if you're gonna dress like a zombie. 
Scratching, biting, clawing. Anything you can to win this game. Oh! Good shit. Nice block. Nice throw. Damn. There we go. Time out! Mm -hmm. Last play. Need a miracle? Not if the quarterback fumbles the snap. Okay. Honestly, if I was on the other team, I'd be like, this is some of the weirdest shit I've ever seen. I want to go home. But brains! Come on! Oh, he wasn't even looking. I love how they that they knew that the quarterback would would, would probably fumble if they just chanted brains like that. Confuse him a little bit. But hey, it's that's one way to win the game. Good shit. Oh. That look from Quinn. The looks from everyone actually are pretty wholesome though. So tell Except me Sue. losers. The economy. Mel Gibson, we'll shoot the them. housing market, <laughs> Dina Lohan, Wall Street, Tiger Woods, the Dallas Cowboys, Brett Favre's She phone, beat out the Dallas Cowboys for Biggest Loser? And Sparky That's Logan. impressive. And how do you feel now that the remainder of the annual Cheerios Thanks, Susan, about to start swinging on you. is going Keep to the up. Glee Club? I'm thrilled. Sue got what was coming to her. And now we don't have to hold a bake sale to pay for the bus to regionals. <laughs> Freaking smile. We could go together to Dalton and apologize to him if you want. Oh, so I don't want to join the Glee Club permanently. What do you think? We all dance around together and win a football game and everything's going to change? I mean, I was kind of hoping it would. Cool and we're all going to sing hippie peace songs every morning? That would be a freaking beautiful life. Top. Why would I want to change things? I think, it, I think it's a good look for you. You're amazing this week. On the field and off. Reminded me of why I loved you. Oh! Oh my god! What? Mmm. Okay, guys, there we have it. Season 3, episode 11 of Glee. This was a really good episode, though. Uh, this actually really was a good episode. I uh, did love the performances. I think the Thriller one at the halftime show, where they added the other song as well with Thriller. And just how Puck gathered everyone together, got the other people back on board, besides freaking uh, Krowski, however you say his name, but he eventually did see the performance and jump in and join the football team again and the halftime show, and the halftime show was freaking amazing, and it seemed like everything was going well. Everyone jumped back into the football game, they ended up winning the game, chanting brains, confusing the other team. Uh, some weird shit happened on a freaking on a football night, but it all happened, and it was all perfect. The looks on everyone's faces were wholesome. The look Quinn was given Finn, the look Krowski had, the look everyone had was so perfect, and it seemed like it changed things for the better. Uh, but no, Krowski's not having it. He's on top of the world. He just won the freaking championship, uh, and things won't change, and he will still be a freaking nightmare to be around. So uh, all of that was for... For what? For nothing? I guess. But, uh, it wasn't for nothing because it was pretty beautiful to see. But still, uh, I wish we did have a little bit of change there. And maybe we will in the future, but who knows? But who knows, honestly. But did really enjoy some of these performances. Uh, the first one with the Cheerios was a bit over the top with the Katy Perry song. But it was a song I haven't heard in a while. And Sue might have thought it was boring, but I certainly did not. It was... It was flashy. It was crazy. Uh, and then we also had the Puck and Rachel duet, which was like very soothing. Puck's voice on that song was, was amazing. He sounded like an angel. And uh, their voices sounded well together, as they always do. But uh, really enjoyed all the performances we got. And Sue, Sue tried to kill some people. Sue tried to kill some people this episode. Uh, with the freaking cannon. And it was gonna put Brittany in there. <sighs> I'm glad, I'm glad we dodged that bullet. And, you know, I'm glad, I'm glad we dodged death ultimately there. But, Sue had a pretty big downfall this episode. 
Uh, losing Quinn, losing Santana and Brittany, uh, and being the biggest loser of the year, having to see the freaking Will interview. It was a rough episode for Sue, but uh, but yeah, it was a good episode for me. Even the freaking Blaine performance with the freaking Warblers, that was a lot of fun. So much fun this episode, but I think for MVP. MVP is the episode. I think we'll we're gonna give we're gonna give it to the whole football team. It was really really good to see them at the freaking halftime show come together and to see them rally back for that win. Uh, it was it was amazing to see and even seeing the freaking girls from the Glee Club join the football team and lay down get kind of bored of laying down. We see Tina almost make the play of her lifetime uh, and it was a bit of a scary moment when she got hit, but. Uh, it definitely was a lot of fun this episode, for sure. But, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this one. Thank you all for watching. I'm out.